Greetings. Welcome back to the channel. Well, today is a exciting day and a nervous day. I said I wasn't going to get choked up on this video. <laughs> but I can't promise that one. I have received my models that I purchased off of uh, Michael Cortell that belonged to Chris Cortell, as you can see by the cup and the t-shirt, which I have drank coffee out of this one, to be honest. I have never wore this. Bought, bought these when they had the sale, uh, back when he was doing the tribute thing. I'm excited, and yet I'm not. As you can see, there's Michael's name. There's one kit in here that I'm going to build. The other two are going to go in my stash. Matter of fact, it'll probably stay right in that box. God bless you and God bless your family, Chris. Michael, if you're watching this, you and Renee, you have my deepest sympathies, along with thousands of other people out there in the modeling community. So we're going to uh, unbox this, or at least open it, take a look at what I got. To be honest, I'm quite nervous. So let me get everything repositioned, and I'll be right back. Well, I'm back. I had to, I'm sorry, I had to take a moment because this is quite emotional. <laughs> Opening up a, a box that belonged to a friend of mine. I wanted to pass along my wishes, best wishes to Michael Cortell and Renee. God bless you both, and everything will be okay. God has promised that. That being said now, we're going to unbox these models that I purchased off of Michael from Chris's stash. And there's one particular model that I'm going to build. The rest are... The other, there's three of them. I'll just tell you right now. The other two will probably stay in my stash. Mm. Except for one. I don't know. We're still thinking on that one. Because I think it's a 1 16th scale, which is okay. I've never built one of those. But I'm going to buy a 1 24th scale of this and make the truck. <laughs> Spoiler alert, there's a truck involved. <laughs> Not a pickup truck, a truck. As in big rig. Anyway, we're going to go on to the unboxing of Chris Cortell's stash. Okay, we're back. And this is a uh, moment for me. <laughs> yeah, I guess it would be for anybody. It's getting one of Chris's models. So I'm going to take my old X-Acto knife with the old double blade 
and we're going to open this. This is quite hard to do. <clears throat> okay, here we go. Oh my. Hmm. Oh my. <laughs> Oh dear. Well, as you can see, we <laughs> we got three of them. This one I got because it's kind of a holy grail. I'm a Sinclair person. <laughs> uh, I was 13 or 14 years old. I was working up the street at the Sinclair gas station. Uh, actually, actually, it was a truck stop, and I remember seeing these trucks. They come in and fill up the tanks. Uh, I washed dishes, pumped diesel fuel, and <laughs> used a ladder and climbed up and washed the windshield on the semis. That was one of the deals when the truck drivers come in. They uh, where they bought gas or not, they got their windshields washed. And trust me, I, I was one busy little kid. But anyway, this one I'm going to probably keep. I'm not going to build it. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I'm not. I, I'm not sure about these scale. I think it's one... 64s. I don't see it on here anywhere. Nice decals. I hope they're good. If I ever open it. There's the kit number. There's the back side. A big pinkies out of the road <laughs> this is a uh, quite an honor Chris and here's a t-bird I know I'm not gonna build that's gonna stay in my stash I like t-birds I have a couple or three I like the 60s, 57s, 58s, into the 60s. I don't have this one, so it was available and I, I asked for it. It's a, uh, nice looking car. Sorry about the reflections. It's all the stupid lighting you gotta have to <laughs> to do the videoing, videoing. Maybe I hold it at a right angle. So there's there's that one, and this one is the one I really really wanted, and I'm glad I got it. I told uh, Michael that this one I am going to build. This is going to be the companion car to a video that you haven't seen yet. I'll go ahead and tell you that it's a video of an Astro Vet. Because this is a companion car for it. Chris helped me out on the Astro Vet. Quite a bit, because I was just getting back into the hobby. I said, I know nothing about airbrushing. He says, oh man, it's easy. I go, okay. Well, I don't know how to do this. Oh, it's easy, just do this. Okay. You know how he was. 
So these two are going to go on the shelf, just in display cases side by side. I'm going to build this for Chris. This is going to be my entry into the uh, group build for Chris, celebrating his life. I think this is an awesome looking car. Now I keep saying I'm not a Corvette person. <laughs> it's like, this makes like number four. <laughs> but I think this car is gorgeous. And it's a privilege to build it for Chris. With that said, <laughs> we're going to put everything back in the, back in the box here. If we can, oh, I'm not sure how it came out of there. Michael did a great job packing it. I can never get stuff back in a box, you know. I don't know how many people can, can and can't do that, but I'm one of those that just has a hell of a time. There we go. So there's my purchase from Michael that, used, that uh, came from Chris Cortell's stash. Been a uh, emotional morning because I've had this for a couple hours before I even opened it. I now decided, well, I'm going to do a video opening it. So I thought it was important anyway. I thank you for watching. There will be a model build video of the Aerovet in a couple of three weeks. I still got to get my airbrushes and all my extra parts out because my paints and stuff are still up here. But I put everything else up, you know. I just camp out some of the exacto knives and stuff. But I still gotta get that all back out so I can start building models. And that's Aerovis gonna be the first one. I have lots more pictures to put up of the builds I did years ago. So stay tuned for those. And the, like I said, the AstroVet video is coming out in a couple of three days. So take care. God bless. Remember, be kind to your neighbors. Like, share, subscribe. Ring the bell. Ding-a-ding-a-ding. -a -ding -a -ding. And we'll see you all later. Bye-bye.